Hey guys, sorry I haven't been posting in a while. YouTube took down one of my videos, so that's why I haven't been posting in a while. But yeah, we're gonna be talking about something different. Well, kind of different, because I've done a video on Roblox before. But we're gonna be talking about a Goat Simulator game that just recently came out, and why it's the best one so far. The game is called Goat of Destructive World. And I would like to mention Zombies has made a video about the game, so go check that out. So it has its own pros and cons, which I'm, which I'm going to go over, obviously. Pros. They use the goat simulator models really well in the game, and for some reason the wasted space goat is here. But hey, I like the helmet he wears. The rag dolls are good, a little silly sometimes, but they glitch out of the map, which isn't a problem because it's because it's really funny though. And the environment is pretty fun overall. So there are a couple of cons though. They don't use the goat simulator music, which is pretty weird, even though if they want to avoid it for copyright, I've used it before and I never get copyrighted. And while I did compliment the map, it's a little too small. And when you first play it, you've probably seen the entire map already. I would like to see an expanded version of the map or add a city in the background like Goatville does. There's only really three character models throughout the entire thing, which isn't really a con, but it would be cool if they added, you know, the other guys into it. But if they can't, that's okay. And also there's this party over here that where these guys are dancing, but they're not doing the goat simulator dance, which is unfortunate. But you know, it is pretty cool to see them do other dances besides the goat simulator dance. I would like to see that in the game, by the way. Now for a couple of ideas. Like I said, there should be like a city in the background. Like you don't even have to go over there. You, you could just see it in the background, you know, just to make the environment feel bigger than it actually is. Or maybe just add funny billboards like in Goat Z. It would be cool if they used the goat simulator music or use uh, this music from Waste of Space. Or like at the dance party, they could be playing this music. And there could be a UFO in the background abducting a cow, which would be funny. Now, why is th this one the best one out of all the Goat Simulator games on Roblox? Well, they usually don't really have much there. Either you're not a goat or you don't even get to headbutt or stuff like that. But at the same time, it's hard to recreate Goat Simulator, so I can see the difficulty. So anyway, I would like to see more from Goat of Destructive World because it is one of the best Goat Simulator fan games I've seen. And I can't wait to see what comes next for this game. So yeah, that's the end of this video. And remember, be what you wanna be and do what you wanna do. I'm out.